Hello, and welcome to this gorgeous two-bed, one-bath apartment on the top floor of this six-unit building. This is a lovely, quaint apartment if you are living by yourself and want an office space, or if you have a roommate or partner and need a little bit more room. Let me take you around. So starting off in the kitchen, we have a lovely brand new fridge, all clean for you to fill with delicious vegan foods, snacks, and whatnot. You also have a top freezer here, very good size, especially for being in the city. Now you will notice that this kitchen has a lot of covered space, so you have the above here. as well as all of the counters here as well. So this is really nice because you have a lot of light coming into the unit and in the springtime there are squirrels and birds so it's really lovely. You've got a really nice double sink here. Get a bit closer. And you can see that this also is detachable for sprays as well which is nice. Okay, so in this kitchen you have all new appliances, as mentioned, all stainless steel. So you have a brand new microwave. And oven as well. Okay, and the dishwasher here. Now moving along to this side of the kitchen, you can see you've got a gorgeous waterfall style. It's not quite an island because it does have the unit there, the wall, but this is really nice for cooking, preparing, all of that with the beautiful white granite style countertops, okay? Now in here you've got beautiful deep drawers to fit pots and pans. You'll also notice that the flooring throughout the unit is this beautiful gray. Now this is just really easy to pair and match with regardless of your color scheme. So you can keep it neutral or do some nice, nice bright colors. Now here you've got all of your smaller drawers which are great for cutlery and small utensils. You've got one, two, three, so now this would be your main living space as well as dining space. So you could set up a nice dining table here in the center or a little nook here. And then you could keep this area more for your living and entertaining. Now what you will notice is, again, this unit has a lot of light. And because you are on the top floor, there is no obstructions, which is amazing. So coming over here, you will see as well that you've got a balcony, okay? Now, ignore the disarray of leaves and whatnot, but it is quite nice in the summer and spring, getting that light in there, the nice cool breeze. Unfortunately, this unit doesn't have AC quite yet, so it will be nice to have that to open up in the spring and get some fresh air in here. You've also got some gorgeous windows with lovely black trim. Now all of the walls are white, freshly painted, so that you can fill them with whatever art you please. Okay, now let's move along to the bedrooms. Oh, also mentioning here that you do have the lip so that you can have some nice stools here to sit at the counter. You also have some outlets as well, which is nice for working. Okay. So, you have this small hallway here, and we'll start off on the left going into the first bedroom. So here is your first bedroom, whether you make this your main room or your office. Pretty simple, not much to it. You've got some nice light coming in. Now, with the way this unit is positioned in terms of sunset and sunrise, you do get more of sunset in this room, okay? You've got a really nice closet here that has a large shelf up top, as well as a nice rack here for hanging clothing. Lovely, okay. And 
And once again, you've got the beautiful windows here with the nice black trim. Okay, so let's go into the next row. Also, one side note, there are three outlets in this unit here in the, in the first bedroom, I should mention. Okay, now let's go to our left here and see the bathroom. Now, everything has been updated just like the kitchen, so although it is small, it is very beautiful. You've got a nice window here to get some light in, but of course, for privacy, you can shut the blinds. You've got some beautiful tiling here, which matches the kitchen counter. Good. And then you have the shower head, which can come off, and you can clean the tub and whatnot. Now, I love especially the light fixtures here with the black detailing to match the black towel. Just all very nice and clean. Now, in terms of the drawers, once again, they are very deep set, which is good if you have taller hair products, makeup products, skincare, etc. Okay. Then you've got your other towel rack as well. So you don't need to add in hooks yourself, which is nice. Good. Okay, not too much for the bathroom there. We can move right along. So one of the main perks with this unit is that you actually have your own washer dryer. So you don't have to pay, which is really nice because in this area, it's a lot of coin laundry. So just opening up this sliding barn door, you have, as mentioned, the washer dryer stack, which is really nice. Not sure how they got it in here, kudos to them, but all brand new, lovely there. Okay, and it just tucks away real neatly with the sliding door. And then you've got your larger of the two bedrooms, so this would likely be your main. So coming in here, once again, you've got some beautiful light. This main window here just really does light up the whole space. It is so beautiful. And once again, the gray flooring is just really simple, clean with the white wall, so you can really do whatever you'd like in here in terms of decor, style, etc. You have your main heating unit, as well as one, two, three outlets once again. Now this is a really nice closet if you have a lot of clothes like myself. You've got one shelf up top as well as an even taller shelf for things you might not use as much, seasonal items. And then this closet actually does tuck in a little bit in here so there is more space. So you can fit lots. Once again, the bar to hang clothes. And the two shelves. So lots of room here either keep this open or shut as well. I personally think keeping it open just makes the space feel even larger. So up here you can also see that the unit does come with your own curtain rods. Uh, that might be a small thing to note, however a lot of the units in this area don't come with that, so you have to buy that yourself, install it yourself, which is a little bit of a hassle. Well just to finish up this tour, we can go into the main space again. I even just appreciate how all of the handles on the doors, sliding doors, all brand new and black to match the uh, fixtures in the rest of the building. Really nice here. Just a little appreciation as well for these beautiful light fixtures. I think that's so modern and cool. Well, that is all for our tour of this two bed, one bath unit. If you have any questions, then feel free to leave them in the comments, but I will let you know that this place has had a lot of activity, so if you are interested, you will have to know sooner than later and submit your application. Now, application is very standard. You'll need to provide first and last, of course, a key deposit as well as a proof of income, any references if you've lived anywhere else, credit check, and ID. Standard things when applying, but as mentioned, there's been a lot of activity, so don't want to pass this one up, especially with all of the gorgeous light. And within this area, having something that has been newly renovated like this is very rare, especially for the price. So be sure that you don't miss out, okay? You can contact the property management or myself in the comments, and I'd be happy to assist you moving forward. We hope that you can picture yourself living here for the upcoming spring and summer. It'd be gorgeous to decorate this, okay? And 
Black House Hunting. I'm happy to help. Bye now.